Hello friends, one of my subscribers had asked me what are the specific exercises that are required for pistol shooting and this is the video that I have added it is part of my video in my training methodology module number three. If you were to subscribe to these modules, you will get not only just these exercises which are related to specific muscle groups used for shooting, but you will also learn everything that there is to be learned for developing your skills to become an international level shooter. So please check this video out. If you have any further questions, please feel free to WhatsApp me. Hello friends. In the last videos, we have progressed to doing eight sets of exercises from exercise one to eight B. If in a session you are going to do about 80 to 120 shots, and if you are going to do two sessions per day, that itself comes to about 240 shots. Now that is a tremendous physical load on your body. And you need to increase your physical fitness to sustain this load. Otherwise, you will develop serious injury. I will be telling you 10 very simple exercises and I advise you to incorporate them in your daily routine. The first exercise is the dumbbell curls as shown in the video. Your dumbbell should not be more than 3 kilos. For ladies, it should be about 2 kilos. And for gents, it can be about 3 kilos. You can do 1 to 4 sets of the dumbbell curls. The dumbbell curls helps in developing the biceps and the forearm flexors and extensors. The next exercise is the dumbbell support curls. They specifically strengthen the wrist, the wrist flexors and extensors. The next exercise is a dumbbell ulna and radial where you take the dumbbell and you move it down and up as shown in the clip. Once again, they strengthen the wrist flexors, extensors, supinators and pronators. The next exercise that I would like you to do is the dumbbell overhead. The overhead dumbbells strengthens your tricep muscles. The next exercise is the push-ups as shown in the clip. And I expect you to do about one to three sets of the same. Now the push-ups strengthen the deltoids, the trapezius, the pectorals, the forearm muscles and the elbow as shown in the clip. The next exercise is the pull-ups. The pull-up exercises strengthen your forearms, your elbows and develop the trapezius. The next exercise is dips on the parallel bar. The dips strengthen your deltoids, your pectorals and your elbow joint. The next exercise is squats as shown in the clip. The squat strengthens your thigh muscles, your knee joints and the basic core muscles. The next exercise is sit-ups. These strengthen your stomach muscles and your back muscles as shown in the clip. And finally, we come to walking. The benefits of walking are shown in the clip.
they greatly strengthen your leg muscles and abdominal muscles. Now the dumbbell curls, I expect you to do about one to four sets. Then the dumbbell support curls, I expect you to do about maximum one to two sets. You can go up to four sets. The same with the dumbbell ulna and radial. You can go from one to four sets. Overhead dumbbells, you can do about one to two sets. Push-ups, one to three sets. Pull-up, one to two sets. Dips, one to two sets. Squats, again one to two sets. Sit-ups, one to four sets. And walking, you can do from anything between one to five kilometers. Now the most important thing in doing all these physical exercises, if you have not been doing any exercises before, I suggest that you move very, very slowly and progressively increase the number of exercises. Believe me, it takes a lot of discipline. But more than discipline, I would suggest that you develop into this habit of doing exercises. Do these exercises five times a week. When I started off doing these exercises, I started off doing very less number of sets. I started with push-ups, then pull-ups, then dumbbells. And gradually I progressed to the numbers that have been shown in the clip.